Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate Google Meet with Slack. First things first, we have to create ourselves a Google account or log into our existing Google account. Once we are in here, in Google Meet, uh, we see our, let's say, workspace. So we can create, for example, a new meeting and so on here. But there's no option for us to actually make this integration happen straight uh, through Google Meet. So we will need help of third-party application. In our case, it will be uh, automate.io. I will leave the link in the description underneath this video uh, for Automate. Uh, Automate.io is a very uh, useful app if you want to make integration between at least two application happen so let's uh let me show you how we can make it happen so once we're here let's go to the top left cor uh, top corner of our screen and click on integrations once we click on integrations let's go to the bottom left part and see all and click on see all categories once we're in here uh, we can start by searching for first app that we want to integrate. In our case, it's Google Meet. We click on Google Meet. Straight away, Automate uh, provides for us this option for integrating the second one, the second application, which will be Slack. Straight away, we get redirected. Uh, to the page with some popular integrations. So those are already pre-made uh, integrations between Google Meet and Slack. So you just basically click on try it now and you'll get redirected just to sign up to automate. But if you won't be able to find uh, the integration that you're looking for, keep scrolling down so you can create your own integration. Just remember on the left side, underneath the triggers. You want to start with uh, Google Meet. So let's uh, click Google Meet. And on the opposite side, underneath the actions, you want to go with a Slack. There's a couple of options, but I'm going with the first one. The last thing we have to say, uh, well, sorry, we have to do is click on Try Now button. Uh, same as before, we get redirected to sign up or no, login or register page. And we just log in to our account and we are a few clicks away from making this integration happen. So that's about it. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.